Hello and welcome to our Christmas party. We are going to have so much fun today and we're going to start right now with some Christmas patterns. Will you help me? What comes next? I see a caroler, a candy cane. Caroler, a candy cane. What do you think comes next? Hmm. <gasps> Nice job, it's a caroler. Let's move him up here. Okay, let's take a look at the next one. I see the nativity, a candle. Nativity, candle. What comes next? It's the nativity, nice job. Okay, let's do the next one. I see an angel, a gift. An angel, a gift. What comes next? Very, very good job. It's the angel. The angel is next. Great job with Christmas patterns, everybody. Okay, next we're going to play bingo. So if you had a chance to print out the bingo board, the link was below so you could get one for yourself, then grab it and let's play. If you don't have one, you can share with me. Let's all try to fill up all the spaces on the bingo board. Okay, can you find the candy cane? You point on the screen or find it on your board and I'll cover it. There's the candy cane, nice job. Okay, what about the next one? Can you find the Christmas tree? The Christmas tree, do you see it? There it is, did you find it too? Nice, nice job. Okay, let's find the next one. Can you find the candle? The candle. There's the candle. Did you find it too? Nice, nice job. Okay, the next one is going to be the angel. Can you find the angel? I found the angel right here on the bottom. Good job, let's find the next one. We're gonna look for Christmas stockings. They look like socks. Can you find the Christmas stockings? There they are, very, very good. Okay, the next one we're gonna look for is the caroler. The caroler is the person that sings Christmas, song, Christmas um, music, Christmas songs at Christmas time. The caroler has some music notes. There's the caroler right on top. Remember, I know we have three in a row, but we're going to see if we can fill up the whole board. Can you find the gingerbread man? Where's the gingerbread man? There he is right here on the bottom. Okay, the next one we're going to find is the gift. Can you find the gift or the present? Oh, what a pretty bow. There's the gift right on the bottom. Okay, the last one we're going to find is the nativity. That's what you call the scene where Mary and Joseph and baby Jesus are. It's called the nativity. Can you find it? It's right in the middle. Very nice job. Well, look, we filled up our whole board. So on the count of three, let's say bingo. One, two, three. Bingo, we won, nice job. Let's play another game, okay? This time we're going to be rolling some dice and then whatever number is shown on the dice, I want you to tell me what we have to do. Here's, here is um, number one. If we roll a one, we're going to cry like baby Jesus. Wah, wah. If we roll a two, we're going to melt like a snowman, melting, melting. If we roll a three, we're gonna do the peppermint twist. We're gonna twist all around. If we roll a four, we're gonna fly like an angel, put our wings out. I don't know, I don't think angels have real wings, but we're gonna fly like an angel with wings. All right, what about this one, number five? We're gonna eat Christmas cookies, yum, 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 yum. And then number six, we're gonna grow. We're gonna get down small and grow really tall like a Christmas tree. Okay, are you ready? Let's roll, here we go. You've gotta tell me what number it is. What number is this? It's the number 
four. Nice job. So if we roll a four, it says we need to fly like an angel. Let's get our wings flapping. Fly, fly like an angel. Remember, it was an angel that told the shepherds that baby Jesus had been born. Okay, let's roll again, okay? Oh, what number is this? It's number five, nice job. So for number five, what do we have to do? <gasps> We're gonna eat Christmas cookies. Um, 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 yummy, what's your favorite kind of Christmas cookie? Um, I like gingerbread men. All right, let's roll again. Oh, it was five, so let me do it again. What's this one? Two, very good. So what do we have to do for number two? For number two, we're going to melt like a snowman, melting, 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 melting. Very nice job. Let's see what the next one's going to be. It's, what number is this? Number three. Let's see what number three is, okay? For number three, we have to do the peppermint twist, 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 twist a peppermint twist. Okay, let's see what the next one is. Let's roll. Okay, what number is this? It's number one. So for number one, let's see what we have to do. I think we're gonna have to cry like a baby. Wah, wah, wah. Cry like baby Jesus. Okay, the next one, let's see what it is. Let's roll. Oh, what is it? Let's see, what number is this? It's number six. Let's see what we have to do for number six. I think we're gonna be, yep, growing like a Christmas tree. Get down really low, get down, get down. And then grow, 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 stretch up, 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 stretch up to the sky. We're a really tall Christmas tree. Oh, that was fun. Now we're gonna learn how to draw something. Now, remember I told you that the nativity was the scene where baby Jesus was in the manger with Mary and Joseph. Well, we're going to draw baby Jesus right now. We're gonna do some, use some shapes to do that, okay? So if you've, if you've been um, to our circle times before, you know we've talked about some different shapes and one of those is a trapezoid. So we're gonna start by drawing a trapezoid. We're gonna kind of do it upside down. A trapezoid looks like this. There's a long side and a short side and two diagonal sides. Okay, next we're going to draw two squares at the bottom of the trapezoid. One, two. Okay, do you have your two squares? Next, we're going to draw a half circle. We're going to put it on the right side of our trapezoid over here on this side. Next, we're going to draw a circle right beside the half circle. Can you tell what this is gonna be? Baby Jesus in a manger. Let's add a sleepy eye and a smile. Very, very nice. And now let's add an angel, okay, to our scene. So remember it was an angel that told the shepherds about baby Jesus being born. So let's just make a triangle over here. And then we're gonna make a circle on the top. And we're gonna make two half circles on each side and an oval on the top. There's an angel beside baby Jesus. So maybe you can draw this today and color it and decorate it. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is it's a birth, someone's birthday. That's why we celebrate Christmas in the first place. It's because it's baby Jesus' birthday. So we're going to sing happy birthday to baby Jesus. Will you help me sing? All right, here we go. I have a birthday cake for baby Jesus. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, baby Jesus. Happy birthday to you. Would you like to blow out the candle? Very good, yay. Well, I have one more thing I want for us to do. I'd like for us to talk about the Christmas story. So for that, we're going to read in our Bible. So 
If you want to, you can pause this and get your Bible and bring it back and we'll read together. Okay, I've got my Bible to you. Turn to Luke 2 and we'll read the Christmas story together before we say goodbye. In Luke chapter 2, it says, And it came to pass in those days that a decree went out from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be registered. This census first took place while Quirinius was governing Syria. So all went to be registered, everyone to his own city. Joseph also went up from Galilee out of the city of Nazareth into Judea to the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was of the house and lineage of David to be registered with Mary, his betrothed wife, who was with child. So it was that while they were there, the days were completed for her to be delivered. And she brought forth her firstborn son and wrapped him in swaddling cloths and, la and laid him in a manger because there was no room for them in the inn. Now there were in the same country shepherds living out in the fields, keeping watch over their flocks by night. And behold, an angel of the Lord stood before them and the glory of the Lord shone around them and they were greatly afraid. Then and the angel said to them, do not be afraid, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which will be to all people. For there is born to you this day in the city of David, a Savior who is Christ the Lord. And this will be the sign to you. You'll find a babe wrapped in swaddling cloths, lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the heavenly, with the multitude, with the angel, a multitude of the heavenly hosts, praising God and saying, glory to God in the highest and on earth, peace, goodwill toward men. Well, I hope you have a Merry Christmas. I'll see you on Monday for more Circle Time videos. Goodbye. Merry Christmas.